Wanda has been a huge support in his recovery. It has really lightened, you know, the load when he's been pricked and poked and <laughs> Wanda comes in and it's just calming that just to pet her and just to have that calm mindset of Wanda coming in. So PetsRx is consisted of four different animal assisted programs and all of them are unique and they are different in ways that serve patients and families in such an important way. We have a really beloved and longtime partnership with Hand and Paw. They're a nonprofit organization here in Alabama that helps provide pet therapy to patients on like a weekly basis. Our PUPS program is um, a program that is full-time at our Children's South Campus. They have two really, really cute poodles, Shelby and Foster, that help patients, families, and staff over there. We also have our Hero Dogs program, which uh, partners with our CHIP Center, and that helps patients who are victims of child abuse throughout their legal process that they might experience. Um, and then lastly, we have our medical dog program. So that is Wanda and I working together with patients to meet some of those treatment goals that they have. We met Wanda about a week or two after his surgery in September. He was admitted September 18th for 31 days and he had a brain tumor in the back of his brain that we had to have emergency surgery to remove it. They removed all of it, praise the Lord and he um, is in chemo right now. He's being admitted today. The first meet was when he actually got out of the bed with PT and he walked in and his face just lit up. I mean, he loves Wanda, he loves big dogs and she just come up with that loving, you know, just he just put his little arms around her and just ate it up. Every interaction that we have is going to be individualized and tailored to whatever patient we're working with. We can help patients ambulate and walk after having you know, pretty big surgery or if they've been in some sort of accident. We can help patients learn how to take new medications. We can help teach them about a new diagnosis or maybe the reason why they're here and what the doctors and nurses are doing to help them get better, kind of bring that down to a more kid-friendly level um, and make it easier for them to understand. It um, has its ups and downs, but coming here knowing we're treated like family has been a wonderful experience. Caden looks forward to playing with the doctors or playing with OT and PT and even Wanda. If he knows we're staying the night, he goes, I get to see, the, see Wanda or play with Wanda. So when I was in schooling to become a child life specialist, I got to see at another hospital during my clinical internship a program like our medical dog program where they had several dogs that were serving patients and families. And so when I started my job at Children's about five years ago, I saw, I was like, we need to have this here. We have to do that. So that's kind of when we started advocating for you know, a program like this. We're very, very thankful to have some generous support from New Core Steel that was able to actually fund um, our medical dog program. Because of them, we were able to bring Wanda here. And she is just someone that I'm really thankful to have as a sidekick.